Phantom Films Wrestling. I am your host, as usual, Derek Winter, here with my co-host, Buttcrack Jack. How you doing this evening? I'm excited for another stellar week. I'm doing great. You're doing great. We got a big night planned, folks. Boy, howdy, I am hungry for nachos, Hyde. But first, before we get to that, let's get to the news. First, uh, J.S. Brody has been cleared to wrestle. I thought he was cleared last week. Oh, he's injured. Okay, and then I guess he just got cleared. I, I need my homie at my side, so that's that's good to hear. That's what I was about to say, because he, uh, he's, he's going to be in the main event tonight, so he better be in 100% condition. And unfortunately, I suffered an injury as well. I got some bruised ribs from that triple threat match last week with Dolph Ziggler and Nick. That's why I rolled out of the ring, dude. It was fucking hurting, you know. I, I, you can call me a pussy all you want, but until you bruise your ribs, you don't know what you're talking about, man. That shit hurts. I think it broke the wind out of you. But absolutely. I could not keep that going. And honestly, I couldn't have been more happier with, I believe, Nick taking that super kick anyway. So at least it was worth it just to see that. But yeah, I'm not I'm not doing too hot. So I'm probably going to stay out of the action this week. <laughs> I'll stick to the commentary booth. It already hurts to talk. But this week, starting out with Nacho Rules, we got Dolph Ziggler and Austin Lee for the new mid-championship inspired by... The hit movie, Nacho Libre, of course. The Nacho rules, keeping it simple. Lucha Libre rules. Everything's basically the same, but it's a 20 count on the outside, and knockouts count. So you can knock out your opponent, which, honestly, I think might favor Ziggler in this match, Hyde. I don't know, man. That that Austin that we were seeing last week, is uh, he's on a different level these days. I don't think he's going to let his coveted championship go on the, on the first week. I think he's going to tear it up. All I'm saying is he better turn that helmet upside down down to cover that super kick because man it only takes one it yeah. actually does you better watch out austin but for everyone's sake please win. especially with a multi-time ffw champion like multiple belts you know he if he wins oh no if dolph wins this he's a grand slampion he has never won the world title oh no, no no not the world title he won the mid that's right that's right that's right yeah that's right. yeah okay, okay. <laughs> He ain't going anywhere near the fucking main event scene. <laughs> <laughs> if I have anything to say about it. <laughs> Stay in the mid card. But after that, we got Tegan Knox taking on Caitlin Harrington in a non-title eliminator match. Caitlin been on quite the tear, beating Rhea Ripley, breeding Kylie Wilson. I think it's time she really <clears throat> takes a step up in competition to take on one of the best women we have on the roster, Hyde, our world champ. Yeah, every time we've seen Tegan, she's been explosive, given those big knees. So I'm uh, I'm excited for this one as well. Titanium shin bones. Yeah. Tuscaria. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 after that we got the new mega powers taken oh, on shit. absolutely <laughs> the new mega powers taken on the spooky suzukis in tag team action after that for a co-main event we got hook with his dad making his first appearance taz taking on outlaw timbo are you guns excited to see this one hide asshole guns away <laughs> yeah I'm, I'm excited to see hook do some work i'm gonna let you that's that's all i'm gonna say on that one but for your main event that's right everyone's favorite more tag team action as the number one contender butch takes on the form or my apologies teams up with the former FFW world champion Grande taking on the butt crack bros JS Brody and our new FFW world heavyweight champion butt crack Jack on our expedition for gold yeah yes <laughs> gotta render them obsolete absolutely exciting regardless let's get to the first match nacho rules Dolph Ziggler Austin Lee mid championship God damn dark as hell. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Very hard <laughs> champion versus champion. <laughs> Interrupting it's the schedule. Four, one fall. <laughs> That's my the MCW <coughs> Mixed Championship. I mean, more concerned. Like he was talking for a long time there. What? What else could he have said? Uh, I said this next contest is for the mid championship, except for one fall. Okay, it just seemed like he was having a fucking chapter one of Harry Potter going on over there. 
but works out either way. Here he is, the former and first ever FFW mid champion, Dolph Ziggler, also first ever FFW tag team champion, which he still is, still defending it to this day. <laughs> Beautiful belt, shitty person. <laughs> I like Dolph. I, mean, I, I love Dolph. I know you do. What do you think about that promo the other day? Whoever cut against it, it was fucking Dork Macklin. I'm like, nobody's ever going to remember the name Dolph or Nick Nemeth. They're just going to say, what happened to Dolph Ziggler? Uh, I didn't see that one, and probably a good thing that I didn't. All those Forgotten Sons dudes are fucking dorks, dude. Capital Absolutely. D, capital O, little R, big K, big S. If they're ever in this company, it's only for jobber work. That's it. They're losing the culinary gangster on a weekly basis. Oh, I am, I am screaming from the rafters. <laughs> oh, holy shit. He's got a sword. He's got a fucking sword. He's oh, got a fucking sword. Oh, dear God. Who gave this man a weapon? What is he doing? <laughs> He's praying to his gods. Or maybe he just really admires it. Man, look at that belt. That looks nice. Whoa! Holy shit! Holy shit. He's a pyromancer. <laughs> Fucking hell. Austin's that's, full that's of surprises. A, that's a steel stage, man. He just pump, he pushed that right through. Man's is on, on god mode right now. Man's on fucking gear. What the hell? <laughs> oh my god. And look at that belt, dude. That strap. They have to get some extra... Uh, it's a terrible camera angle for it. But yeah, they have to get some extra long straps for that guy. You can't handle all that power. Oh, man. Looking great, though. Belt's looking great on him. Dude might have lost a screw or two on the process to get that belt, but, man, it looks great on him. Oh, yeah. Admiring his work. Everything he's fought for up until this point. He's got his own custom belt. Beautiful. The newest mid-champion. The greatest Lucha Libre superstar of all time. Austin Lee. Lucha Libre! Oh, man. I'm very excited for this match. Of course, as I mentioned earlier, this is under Nacho Rules. 20 count on the outside, pin, submissions, and knockout apply. There it is, the beautiful mid-title. Of course, inspired by... The Nacho Libre film. Not gonna lie, creating that belt was a pain in the ass. There's like very little images and very little video of it. So in some parts it took some liberties, but hey, fuck it. <laughs> and fuck you, Dolph. I'm interrupting all your shit. And his opponent from Jefferson City, Missouri. Dolph's the greatest. He is the FCW mixed champion. Austin, the Viking, Lee. Oh, yeah. Such a pretty belt. This is going to be one exciting match. One hell of a way to start off the show, Hyde. I cannot wait. The ref showing Dolph the belt he'll never get again. Oh, yeah, it's official. That belt up in the air means it's official. Dolph Ziggler, Austin Lee, one on one. Let's get it on. Oh, immediately Dolph go for punches, but Austin throwing strikes of his own, showing off his striking skills. Ooh, big oh, big fist God, drop, dude. That's an add new one right off the get go. Get your shit out, John Cena. <laughs> Waba do. Oh man. Austin showing off his power. Oh, but Dolph showing off his craftiness. Big stun gun on the outside. But Dolph, a domino stretch. And he's got the leg, Natalia style. Stretching away the big man. Impressive strength on Dolph, I'm not going to lie. But Austin is way too squirmy, way too crafty. Gets right out of that. Also, right away with the collar now. But oh, immediately with the clothesline. A second clothesline. Seen this before. Ripcord. Drop kick! Right out the get-go! 
Oh, but he's not done yet. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Those, that squash watermelons. Dude, those big-ass legs. Some people <laughs> might be into that. <laughs> but I don't want Austin doing that to me. Oh, no. oh, no. Watch your dick. Oh, my God. Watch your dick. He has it on the tights. People need to get Duolingo and start learning to read. <laughs> Whoa, the power. He just pushed off right off of him. Oh, it's a... Sp Oh, whoa, Lucha Libre! Lucha Libre! <laughs> Impressive work there from Austin and DDT! Oh man, clean work from Austin Lee here tonight, making it look easy, but only a count of one. Oh, Austin still looking to square up. Dolph cannot get a hold of Austin. He's just too big. He's too girthy. Ooh, what a chop! Oh, guy's got the leg tied up. Oh, he's cracking away, working the knee. Oh, Dolph is limping. Oh, already. Oh, like a blue thunder bomb. Oh, my goodness. Could this be over this early? Man, Austin's on a tear. No, not all this time we're wasting. No, I think he was trying to get to the ropes or the top turnbuckle, but Dolph was in the way. Oh, with our clothesline. Oh. But Dolph able to avoid it. That's how Enzo got concussed. It is. And it's about to get a lot worse with this sleeper. Can Austin get out of it? Oh, with ease. He gives up his back, but he's able to flip him off. Try that in the UFC. Oh, again, <laughs> like a melon. Oh, point to the elbow. Dolph wisely getting out of there, but Austin is not someone that'll give you a break. His stamina is next to none. Dolph stumbling up to his feet. Oh, big clothesline on the outside. Austin putting on a barn burner right now, but Dolph able to trip the leg of the Lucha Libre superstar. Of course, it can go up to a count of 20 right now, so you can honestly really take your time if you want to. Dolph's taking full advantage of that. But Austin Lee isn't having it. Get him back in the ring. You can, you can only really win from the inside. Oh, he's trying to call him up. Oh, but to, tried to show off to the show off a little too much. Austin Lee's had enough. Right back into the ring. Woo! Big shot from Dolph. And a DDT planted the champ. Dolph to go right on the offensive as soon as he got in. Not. Oh! Barely a one count. Whoa! The kick up! Oh my god. The athleticism. The spike DDT! Move that won him championships. Or at least defended him championships. It was the first bloodiest match for the tag team champions. Super kick! Oh my god! Could Dolph steal it? Two! What the fuck? Oh my god. Jesus Christ! Dude, Austin dominated that whole match and it only took one it super only kick? takes one. God damn it! I gotta stop putting this guy in matches. <laughs> Dolph Ziggler is the first ever two time FFW mid champion. God damn it, Austin. FCW God damn it. You had one job. Dolph oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> oh. Sorry, folks. Didn't mean to start the show off with a fucking downer. <laughs> but Dolph Ziggler is your new FFW mid champion. God damn it. Wait, what's going on? Oh, shit. We got some stuff going on backstage. Thank God. Interrupt this bullshit. Let's get some cameras on that. Oh my god, well, Mike Austin has a table? What the fuck? Oh, but Odie Logan has the table now. <laughs> He's going to get revenge for last week. Obviously, oh. temper's boiling over from last week still with these guys. Even an interesting ongoing rivalry, but last week might have been the, uh, the straw that broke the camel's back. I mean, he got straight fucked over. He did that awesome bomb, avalanche awesome bomb from oh. the top. Just slapped the shit out of him. Stockton, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, God, Mike Austin with the trash can. Oh, <laughs> German on the concrete in the trash can. More probably the concrete than anything, though. I, I, compared to concrete, you know, I feel that trash can. What the fuck? What is he going for? Whoa. Oh. Mm. That angel's wings? Man. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> this is how you know it, it's it's still over or, or it's boiled over. The the golden rule in wrestling is like you're trying to win, but you still need to to make sure that your opponent's not getting like massively injured. These guys are hurting each other right now back on this concrete. Seriously, like oh I, my oh, god, 
I don't know who initiated the fight, but I can only assume Mike Awesome. And who can blame him? Oh, DDT from Oni there on the concrete. Jesus. Fired up right now. He's pissed. Oh, big shots. Mike Awesome will firing right back. The big man. Oh, Jesus Christ, no. He's looking for it. Got him up. Awesome bomb on the concrete. Oh, man. my God. Awful. Just awful. We can't just be injuring people like this. Oh, dear God. What has he got? A butterfly lock again. Oh, butterfly oh suplex. Somebody needs to get a handle on this. Someone get security. Something. Do we even have security? Oh, no. Oh, Jesus Christ. Big German toss. Oh. Oh, my God, bro. Almost got yellow line to yellow line. <laughs> that would have been very impressive. But he's got another chair. Oh, right on the back. Oh, but Oni's able to kick the second one off. Mike Awesome going straight after Oni. Oh, Jesus Christ. Not again. Not again. Onto the ladder. Awesome bomb. Oh, my God. How much more can Oni take? Christ. And again with the chair. Just going after Oni Lorcan. Absolutely vicious display. He is trying to put him on the shelf. Oh, Lord. But Oni fighting back. Oh, big kick. Oh, Dragon Whip working the knee, but Mike Awesome straight back to his feet. Oh, but the big elbow from Oni Lorcan. Mike Awesome though firing back, unfazed by all of it. Club and blows. Stomping on the leg. Whoa! <laughs> Disappeared behind the boxes. What elevation from Mike Awesome with that awesome splash. Oh, and again with the German into the... Oh, into the metal beam! Dear God, someone stop this! Oh, cracking the knee down. Oh, God, Mike Awesome with the chair. Oh, I can't see it, but it's looking rough. Oh, my. Oh, Jesus, not again. Not again. Awesome. Oh, bomb. my God. Oh, my God. For all we know, he could have fallen to the pits of hell. I don't even see his body right now. Somebody get a ref in there. Something. Jesus. Mike, what the hell are you doing? I'm sick of your shit and you're gonna die! Mike, calm down. There's no need for any of this. Look, Mike, I understand your concerns, but we as a commission have a high standard to hold and everything, and, and we back our referees, and the referee's decision is final. I understand you might not like that, and it might not be the most popular decision, but we have to back our referees in the decisions that are made. I'm gonna have to rip your goddamn head off and pin your shoulders to the mat for the one, two, three! Because I want that belt back, punk! <sighs> Dear God, that was that was awful. Uh, we we gotta get the show going on. We got EMTs of some kind back there. We'll get Oni Lorcan checked out. Uh, Send him to awesome. a local medical facility. But Mike, awesome, Jesus, that guy, that guy gets to get handle on himself. I know, I know it's rough, man, but Jesus, you can't just be attacking people and demanding shit around here. That's not how it works. But anyway, let's get back onto the show here. Caitlin <coughs> Harrington versus the FFW Women's Champion Tegan Knox in a title eliminator match. Let's get it going. All right, we are back. Oh, 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 oh. spooky shit. The follow -up. It's scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from Manchester, New Hampshire. Very slowly, but, but still. Caitlin Harrington. Uh, Caitlin. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't want to interrupt the, the announcers. <coughs> my, my headphones are too good. I can't, uh, I can't hear the announcers. I'm, I'm sorry. No, no, you're, you're good. You're good. He's not uh, talking right now. She's just walking. Fantastic. All right. Thank you, buddy. So... Yeah, Caitlyn adapting more of a strong style, shooter style lately. Uh, training with who we found out last week was Hook and Samoa Joe. Very crazy. I think my partner just had a stroke. You all right there? <laughs> yeah, my, my phone dropped. I'm sorry. Oh, you're, you're good. Just making sure. That was a, that was a hell of a thud. Uh, but regardless, definitely a more aggressive side, if you will. I Honestly, I don't think she even really needed it, but... She could just be staying on top of the game right now. Don't want to get too... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? 
too, uh, not generic, but, like, too predictable. Cliche. Yeah. Predictable. Yeah, cliche, predictable. Don't want to get figured out, because she's only lost once, I think. One time, one time. I think I was during the, the tournament, so... Honestly, doing good. Oh no, against Victoria. She lost against Victoria. That's right. But after that, she's been on a tear. Been on top of her game. And I'm excited to see what she can bring to the table today. That cape almost looks like it says AJ on it. What that song even mean? I'm so confusing. From Cardiff, Wales, the oh, MCW Tegan Knox back at it again, being sassy champion, for some reason with the belt because Game Universe Mode doesn't say fucking victory edits. Jesus fucking Christ. All right, any, no, anyway, looking very sassy. <laughs> we haven't seen her in a while. Maybe she's just frustrated, you know, because she hasn't been on TV all that much, and I feel bad. I do. I like seeing Tegan in action, but like. You know, there's been a lot of storylines going on. There hasn't really been any women's storylines except for between Kylie and Caitlyn, which is crazy to think of considering the world champion isn't even in a storyline. She's just here. She's just the world champion. Just here. It's like a Bob Backlund sort of scenario, which, to be honest, I mean, maybe Bob Backlund was in storylines, but I'm not 80 years old, so I couldn't tell you. Oh, but Tegan immediately throwing Caitlyn over, showing the power difference. Socking her one. Showing off that Welsh aggression. Straight after. This will be a great test, because, I mean, Caitlyn has already beaten a WWE Women's Heavyweight Champion, but can she beat an FFW Women's Champion high? Do you think it's possible? Oh, big boy Centon. That's one of those. That's a new move right there. Oh. I've not seen that one, but always nice to update the Arsenal every now and then. Absolutely. Oh, calling her in. Oh, ho, ho, ho. crafty, crafty move there from Caitlyn. Tegan right back in the ring looking pissed. But Caitlyn right on the offensive here. Calling elbow drop down. Oh, kitchen sink. Tegan flying over her knee. Oh, God, got her up. Inverted suplex. Man, the aggression here. Immediately going for the cover. Smart move. Stay on top of the champ. One. But only a one count. Big kick out. Oh, Caitlin really just showing off now. Not a great idea. Oh, what a forearm from Tegan Knox. Getting her paces back with a big chop. And a neck breaker. Tegan looking again, collar and elbow, Irish whip, and a big single leg drop kick. Vintage Tegan knocks it going straight after her with ground and pound punches and a kick to the belly. Tegan another big chop, two chops, big kick, team kick at it again. Then Sagiri. Caitlin crawling herself over to the corner. Oh, playing possum though. Big kick to the belly and a drop kick, tossing Tegan knocks across the ring. Another Irish whip here. Caitlin. Oh, oh. big a uh, little arm neck breaker there. Very clean. Oh, Tegan not able to avoid that grapple attempt. Tegan throwing Caitlin into the corner. Could be setting up for something here. Oh, oh, big super kick to the knee. Oh shit! Welsh destroyer! Oh my god. They got the cover! Ref not in place, well, one! Welsh Sunrise? Uh, for Tegan, it's the Welsh Destroyer. Oh my god. Yeah, whoa, but Caitlyn set right up! But, oh, Tegan staying right on top of her, and that's why she's the world champion, but Caitlyn with the sneaky little pin! One! Oh! Was it enough to put down the champ? Oh, V-Trigger! She just said no, no, no. <laughs> oh, now Tegan running up in the corner now. Oh, but Caitlyn said, oh, the knees. Oh, she's shaking out the cobwebs right now. Tegan doing some damage. Oh, again, inverted uh, suplex. Oh. 
Kalen's feeling it. The energy here tonight. Oh, boy. Got some big forearms coming in hot right now. Duck under. Double low kick. Oh, my God. Tegan in the corner. Can't look. Oh, big forearm. A kick. Oh, look at this. Exploder suplex. Learn that one from Hook. Go for the cover. One, two. Only a two count on the champ. But very impressive so far from Caitlin. Oh, soccer kick to the back. Showing that shoot style, that aggression. Oh, but Tegan not afraid to shoot back. Big Irish whip. Oh, but not able to quite get all of it. Tegan got Caitlin up on her shoulder. She looks really small compared to her. Oh, my God, snake eyes. One and only a one count. How are you feeling right now, Hyde? Your wife's in there. She's getting the business, but she's also about to get the shiniest wizard. Tegan keeps chopping her down so she can get her in that spot before that. Oh, oh. but Caitlin able to kick out the champ's greatest hit, and Caitlin was able to kick out of it. Oh, looking for maybe a little exploder there, but Caitlin was able to get out of it. Got the Irish whip and another single leg drop kick from the champ. Oh, setting up and possibly another shiniest wizard. Oh, the spin kick this time, throw it off. And oh, the shiniest wizard. God. It got the cover. One, two, three. <laughs> two times. Unbelievable. Caitlin Harrington with something to prove. But Tegan Knox is looking to end this. Oh, my God. Spike Dudley stopped there in the chest. Another cover. Two. Oh, and another kick oh out. Oh, my God. Is this an AEW match? <laughs> Fight forever. <laughs> Caitlin wisely getting out of the ring. Tegan Knox is not done. Oh, God. I think she's flipping her off right now. <laughs> Whoa. Suicide oh dive. Suicide come alive. Oh, knee missed on the concrete. Oh, go for the feature. Oh, shit. The kick to the side of the head. Oh, my God. These two are going at it. What an instant classic. Oh. Kaylin throwing Tegan into the steps, picking up on the outside. Let's set up for another V-trigger, but no, getting back in the ring. There's only one place this match can truly end. Tegan Knox responding to the disrespect, getting back in. Oh, big push there from Caitlin. Elbows, kicks. Oh, blood for Shaba. Holy shit. Could that be enough to put out the champ? She's not done. Oh, here goes her kick. That's a new move. She's adapted. Got the cover. Oh, only a two count. Wow. Oh, gosh. She's setting up for something here. Could be looking for a jaded, perhaps. Oh, but Tegan able to have it scouted. Got her back, but Kaylin also having it scouted. Woo! Dragon! Boom! Boom, boom, boom! Rings of Saturn! He's got it locked in, but the chip! Oh, he be oh, able to get oh. out of it. Wow, that's the first time she's used that. Oh! oh and a drop kick. Wow, this is way more competitive than I was honestly thinking. But the honestly. big kick and a shiniest wizard! <coughs> Cut the, rope, cut the rope, cut the rope, cut the rope. No one's ever kicked out of three. No. Nope. Oh, man, what a fucking match, though. Jesus Christ. Captivating for sure. Impressive performance. You can definitely see the improvements from Caitlin Harrington here tonight, but Tegan Knox is the champion for a reason. Wow. Showing off that new aggression, that new moveset. Here is your winner. But Tegan Knox at the end. Fox. Still... Well, it wasn't for the title, but still your champ anyway. Champion. Champion. Kate will have to work her way back up a little bit. Take some more time. There's nothing to be ashamed of. Not after a performance like that. Let's get on to the next match. Because up next, it's going to probably be a long one, folks. <laughs> we have the new Mega Powers taking on the Spooky Suzukis. We are back. All right. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is the first time we've seen the new Mega Powers here in FFW outside of a tournament, folks. Oh yeah. Oh yes. They came crashing down and they're planning on putting the hurt on the Spooky Suzuki's here tonight. John Cena looking great. Haven't seen him since, yeah, literally the fucking tournament. I'm pretty sure. Is it criminal? Possibly. But, you know, we got to keep this guy tamed. We don't want him mm -hmm. running amok in the singles division. <laughs> a thousand percent true. You thought Dolph was bad. Fuck. <laughs> Very exciting, though. Very exciting to see these guys back. A lot of high hopes for this team, the Mega Powers, but really just haven't got the ball rolling, especially compared to these guys right here. Spooky Suzuki's first appearance since the first Blood Tag Team match. Uh, really did a number on them. Have been out of action for quite some time, but now it looks like it's time to get back into the tag title picture here tonight. Had to, had to recollect. It's okay. It happens. And their opponents at a combined weight. It was a tough loss. They got screwed over in the first match, and then they lost basically a one-on-two match. <laughs> or a two-on-one with Dolph. Or no, was it a one? I don't remember how that match went. It's been it's been a few weeks. My memory is quite short hide. Which one? Uh, the blood, the first blood match. Uh, I can't remember if it was a two-on-one and Dolph bloodied them both. Yeah. Well, Dolph is just a fucking unstoppable force. <laughs> Granted, I did call that that match would favor him, so really I should just blame myself on that. However, impressive nonetheless. These guys are still the top contenders in the division. And they're looking to try to keep that here tonight here against the new Mega Powers. See if they can get themselves a rematch here soon. You never know. I want my rematch. Absolutely. They should... To see if they deserve it. I mean, they beat someone like the former mid-champion Kenny Omega and someone like John Cena. There's no reason why they can't. You get it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here we go. John Cena. FFW ring. Here we go. Taking on Bray Wyatt. Whoa! Whoa! What a power slam. God, that was quick. Very quick. Holy shit! Another one! <laughs> okay. Two big power moves that gets the fuck out. <laughs> I mean, he's only got five moves. That's fair. That was one of them. <laughs> oh, axe handle. Oh, what a clobbering blow, though, from the Eater of Worlds. Going after the former mid champion. Oh. Working over the leg. Get that V-trigger out of here. Oh, Suzuki and Omega. Here we go. It's about to get stiff. Whoa, Suzuki. Oh, big belly to belly. Immediately going for the pin. One. Oh, surprisingly, you just got a, only a one count. I was thinking probably less than one, one to be honest. Whoa, they're about to slap the shit out of him. Oh, high rake from Kenny Omega. Played a dirty Frankensteiner. Throwed him into his partner's corner. Not very smart. Never call it a oh. Karana on FFW. Oh! <laughs> He's going for another Frankensteiner. It got alley-ooped onto every turnbuckle on the way down. Oh, Minaro. Oh, headbutt. Headbutt. Trying to bust himself open at this point. Mad o Omega just kicking up. Oh, big mat slam. Going to Pagan. Pe Pagan? What the fuck? Tagging. Oh John Cena. <laughs> oh. Oh, but Monaro's got a big hold of John's fucking massive neck. Bring a Bray right back in. Oh, this double Irish whip. Big double back body drop. Laying out the former WWE champ. Bray, oh, busted open Cena with that big head, but one, but only a one count. Dear God, first move I think Cena took besides that back body drop. He's already split open. Another Irish whip here. Oh, Bray. John Cena's able to blast out of it, but John's able to block that crossbody as well. Collar and elbow. John taking it back to his corner. 
Oh, what could they have planned here? Big Irish whip. Drop toe hold. Elbow drop. Keeping it nice and simple. Basic fundamentals. Basic thugonomics. Whoa! I didn't even hear the Terminator thuds. I'm untouchable, but I'm forcing you to feel me. <laughs> big, oh, big elbow on the outside. Throw in Bray Wyatt right back into the ring. John Cena not looking great in the corner there. Oh, again. Oh, evading the cross body. And Omega with the drop kick to the back of Bray's head. Going for the pin. One, but only a one count. Can you make a ticket Bray right back up by the cord rose, but Bray is fully aware. It's been like dreads. Yeah. Oh, those giant boots to the face, though. Ow. He's stunned after that one. Oh, Bray double the choke slam center of the ring. Bray oh, stopping away at those legs. Those big ass boots. Oh, John was in there to stop that. I'm sure that would have gotten the pin easily. Bray. Probably. Oh. <laughs> Bray. oh, looking for possibly Uranagi or something there. Oh, V-Trigger! Oh, oh, it oh. was V-Trigger. He didn't even, he wasn't even close. Mm -mm. Oh. Bray was too quick. Ferrari or whatever they said. Engine something. Yeah. <laughs> oh, again! Jesus, Bray's busting everyone open. Sending a message to the, to the new Dirty Dogs, arguably, right now. Already busted open the two contenders here. Oh, but another back body drop. Loving themselves a double back body drop. Oh, Suzuki! He's got him up! Gotch! Power driver! Oh my god. Oh, but he's not done! We've seen this before! He's got he's got the choke! He's got the rear naked choke! Power driver to the choke. Hilarious. Oh, he's got it locked in tight! John's gotta get in there! Oh, just barely getting in there. Kenny could not have been holding on much longer. Ref, get a hold on this match. Oh, Suzuki wisely throwing Cena out of the equation. Oh, Suzuki slapping away, going after the cleaner. I had a tiny AA. Just sticking it to Cena on the outside. <laughs> With Suzuki. Oh, looking for Brigham and Bray's corner, but Kenny had it scouted. He's trying to shake off those cobwebs after getting dropped on his head. Another Frankensteiner. <laughs> Suzuki getting back up. Oh, this time. Oh, the Suzuki this time being away. These two might have to actually face each other for once. Oh, a big crossbody. Oh, John really desperate for that tag right now. He's only done, I think, actually three moves in this match. Total. He's had a lot of time off. <laughs> recovering from a million injuries that he magically recovered from. Oh, but Suzuki bringing, him, uh, bringing Omega back into the corner with Bray. Oh, Suzuki and Bray got here. Another big Irish whip. Oh, double shoulder tackle. Kenny is not looking good right now. Oh, boy. Getting the crab walk. At least it's not very far distance this time. Very short. Oh, he's got a bop. Big smooch. Sister Abigail. <laughs> Kenny straight to his feet. Holy shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> selling the fuck no out of it. No sell to a one run. Oh, what? Now, oh, oh. There was no way Bray was going to be able to kick out of that. Oh. <laughs> Just punched Suzuki and moved Dude, on. Yeah, what? <laughs> <laughs> Stiff the fuck out of him real quick. Oh, Bikini, he's looking drained. That one wing angel took it out of him. It's time to bring in the big guns. Wabadu. Oh, made up a claw. <laughs> John Cena does a tap out. Oh, but he might go out. Got the cover. One, two. Oh, Cena able to kick out. Follow the buzzards. John Cena coming back to his feet here. He has not had a great run of it. This is why he's not been on television. Oh, <laughs> again, Suzuki back in the match. Another Irish whip. What can we see here? Another back body drop. <laughs> Loving that move. But John wisely getting out of there. Whoa, Suzuki up top. He's too old for this shit. I don't think I've ever seen him on the top rope. Oh, axe handle. I don't know. Sting be doing some wild shit, so I'll let him do it. 
That's fair. Oh, <laughs> he got it back on Omega. Stiffened him twice. Three times. Oh, got greedy. <laughs> Suzuki. Not having it. Oh, God. He's got John up. Oh, trying to suplex. Well, Suzuki doesn't look that strong, man, but he's a strong old man. Oh, oh, Cena, though. Able to see it coming. Big elbows. Oh! What, what are the other five moves? He's got the shoulder tackle. The th third move! Inverted suplex! Oh, he doesn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> that FFW he does. <laughs> Fifth move, DDT. That's all his moves. <laughs> Nothing else. <laughs> oh, shit. Palm strike. Bring it back to his pancreas roots. Putting Cena in the corner. Oh, tearing away at the arm, though. The surgically repaired arm. Oh, I think. <laughs> Tear it away. Suzuki. Irish whip into the corner. Ooh! It's like a Claymore or something there. Big something from Suzuki. Got the cover on Cena. But only a two count on Big Match John. Maybe that's why he's not doing so well. Maybe he isn't considered a big match. Oh, but we have to roll up. One. Oh, only a one count. Oh. Yeah, see, not only wins, but it truly matters. Maybe he just doesn't think this matters. Maybe he doesn't care about the tag team division that much. Bing. He is John Cena. Oh. <laughs> fisherman Buster! It's like a Fisherman Brain Buster. Holy shit. A big punch. These two just been sticking it out all night. Oh, just choking away. We've seen that choke in matches. Not from Omega, but we've seen it. Oh, knee to the arm. Working over Suzuki right now. He's trying to slow it down this late into the match. Yeah. Throwing Suzuki to the corner here. Omega. Flipping him over. Oh, he's got him. Into the turnbuckle. The ring post there. Oh, he's just choking him again. Jesus Christ, ref. Get a hold of him. Get a hold of this match. This is ridiculous. We need to look into our refs here on the FFW payroll. You think? <laughs> Fucking non-stop shit backstage, hand jobs. Fuck all of it. Well, Cena, though, it's his sixth move. His sixth hidden move. Oh, my God. It's the, this is 06. It's the FU. He's got the cover. One, two. Oh. But Bray able to kick out. What can't I see, John? You can't see him. Oh, he gave it his best shot. Time to bring in the other big guns. <laughs> drop toe hold and elbow drop. <laughs> Classic tag team wrestling here in FFW. Oh, woo! So, hold on. Du, 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 du. Okay, there we go. <laughs> another Terminator two play. And another elbow too, man. I feel like I've seen this before. <laughs> Can he? Oh, throwing brain to the steps. Oh, Jesus, going right after him with an axe hand. I'm not even giving him a time to process the pain. Oh, socking away. A defenseless Bray Wyatt right now, if you will. Up against the corner. Ooh. Oh, trying to possibly get a count out. Oh. Oh, he's pointing to the guy. He's gonna shoot him. Oh, okay, he didn't do it. <laughs> His guys attention turned to Suzuki. <laughs> Suzuki dodged it. They're fighting. You got to fight going on in the ring. <laughs> Someone break this up. Okay. Bray White's back in. Suzuki was getting the upper hand of Omega there. <laughs> oh. Suzuki just shooting, bro. I think there's some real beef here between Omega and Suzuki. You got to get that sorted. Oh, but Bray White. Oh, just tossing it back into the corner. Making that cut way worse. Oh, big old back body drop. Yeah, that's right, folks. Bring out your back body drop signs. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Suzuki going after Omega. Eyeballing John Cena. He's doing a full lap right now. Get his cardio in. Victory. Victory oh. <laughs> he tried to juke out Cena, but Cena's all coming a mile away. But Suzuki isn't one to give up. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Suzuki. A <laughs> uh, drop kick to Cena. And straight back to Omega. Oh, and 
Another Claymore kick from Suzuki. We got a cover. One. Oh, Kenny, though, able to easily grab the ropes. No problem whatsoever. I got get back in the Eater of Worlds. Oh, near the Kenny. Oh, we got some dogs here at the announce table. Where's the security? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Oh. Oh, big shot to the back from Omega. Like on the forearm, the elbow. Oh, he's choking away Bray Wyatt. Jesus. Oh, Omega. Adding enough. Getting seated back into this match. Oh, oh. <laughs> Cena getting his comeuppance on Suzuki. Oh, but Bray. Had enough of that. He's got him up. Big. Oh, snake guys in his corner, but Suzuki's out. Oh, big boy sin time. Not going for the cover yet. Oh, and a club and blow from Bray Wyatt to John Cena, taking him down. Oh, he's got the man of the claw again. But John Cena, he never gives up. But it doesn't matter how many fingers are down his throat, he will not give. Oh, oh and Bray's <laughs> busted open this time. And Bray, oh, big, big vertical suplex there. There's a snap to it. Bray, oh, setting up his own elbow, but John Cena able to get away with the big boot. Oh, John, he's going up right now, but Suzuki's right there. Oh, but he's not phased by it. We've seen this before. Is he go oh, he's looking for his leg chop, but Bray wisely crawling away. <laughs> Picking a spot. I like it. Yeah, yeah I, I respect it, but it's Suzuki's turn now. Oh, Suzuki caught him. <laughs> Gotch pile driver. What is Xbox doing? Stop it. Holy shit. Okay, you know what? This is worth breaking some news. Austin, Austin Lee, the former mid champion, he just bought me Boulder's Gate 3. You Holy shit. On what, the PC? On Xbox. Oh, nice. Fuck yeah, thank you, Austin. I appreciate it. Oh, what a move from Austin. Sorry to interrupt the, uh, the broadcast, but that was worth the shout out. What a homie. Much appreciated. I gotta get some Boulder's Gate content on this channel. Speaking yeah. of this channel, don't forget to leave a like. With my taxes, I'll get it on my Xbox so I can join you. Fuck yeah. They just need to make that game crossplay already. But I know they're just trying to make they're just trying to take their time, you know, make sure they it's done right if they do. Oh get big elbows to Omega. Goodness, god damn. After the Japanese sensation. And John Cena back into the ring. Wabadoo! He's feeling the energy of the live crowd here tonight. Oh but Suzuki not having any of it. He's got him. He's got the choke in tight. Right in front of Omega, he's just taunting him. Oh, but John Cena. Wait! Oh my god. Did he go to sleep? I think he went unconscious. Holy he shit! The spooky Suzuki's man, holy fuck. <laughs> Minoru Suzuki is a goddamn threat. <laughs> Basically taking the shooting on the, the mega powers. <laughs> and then choking out John Cena. What the fuck? I mean dropped him on his head a few times. At least once. I think one of them was to Omega. Doesn't matter, but man, the Spooky Suzuki staying on top of the tag team division winners, clearly here tonight. Minor, and Bray Wyatt. Oh, they might have another date with the new Dirty Dog sometime here in the new, near future. And follow the buzzards, of course. <laughs> Let's get to the next match. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, Hyde. I have been looking forward to this one. Yeah, boy. Hook, Outlaw Timbo, up next. See this ring right now. Oh, it's a masterpiece.
What are you doing? Oh, shit. It's either Action Brunson playing right now or it's the, the Team Taz theme, depending on uh, YouTube's copyright. <laughs> Here he is, making his singles debut here tonight. The cold-blooded, handsome devil, Hook. With his father, of course. Taz. Taz Jones. <laughs> Motherfucker Jones. <laughs> Hook looking great, even though coming off of a loss here in his debut with Samoa Joe. But regardless, everyone knows that Hook is a threat. And with the tutelage of his father with him, too, of course. I mean, anything is possible for this young man. Looking to be in impeccable shape. Best shape I've ever seen him in. All taped up. Ready to go. Handsome AF. Very. New shirts here available. Handsome AF hook shirts. <laughs> oh. They're making his first official the entrance the here. <laughs> Outlaw Timbo. Outlaw <laughs> Don't look directly into his eyes, whatever you do. He'll follow you around for three hours. Non stop. Don't get me started about Burger King. Blue collar man. Fucking brown collar, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just not breaking eye contact with Hook. I hope Hook's looking the other way like he normally does. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Get him the fuck away! <laughs> Camera man, push him! <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, Dexter Lewis was a good call. <laughs> <laughs> Creepy ass bastard. I think I see BK on his back too. That's pretty great. I saw that when he slid into the ring. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking turn away. <laughs> God damn. Outlaw Timbo. <laughs> Trading the, the drags for the cowboy hat. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Gotta, gotta be aware of his dreaded finishing move. Have it your way. <laughs> Have it your way, also known as the Timbo suplex. Oh, God. Going right after Hook, though. Jesus. Oh, a sit down power bomb. See, there's the BK on his back. And also, oversized load. <laughs> oh, my God. Tim. Jesus. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Taking it to Hook. Oh, I think he caught Hook off guard there. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that sort of aggression right to get go. Oh, big clothesline from the handsome devil. Oh, but Tim, what the fuck? Fighting back. This is like a culinary gangster Austin Lee scenario right now. Jesus, Alabama Slam. <laughs> Tim, very proud of himself, but Hook is not impressed. Picking up the big man, the big small man. Snake eyes. Going for the cover immediately. We're only a one count. Taz looking in disapprovement. Oh, going after the arm of Tim. We've got the cross face, but Tim's foot landed on the rope. Oh, just firing away against on Outlaw Timbo. Taz looking a lot happier this time. <laughs> and firing a ball. Big shots right to the face. Oh, busted open Timbo. Do apologize. I was going to give you this match, but... uh. You got some bigger things going on your plate, so I figured take some oh Tim moving, take some take some time off, but we'll we'll get you this match, I don't you worry. There you go. Oh oh, what is he going for? Going for a Boston crab on the outside? What the fuck? That's not how it works, Tim. BK crab. <laughs> oh whoa! Looking for okay, that's not how that works either. Hook. All right. Both these guys here work on their ring awareness. Hook throwing Timbo back inside the ring. Tim is bleeding all over the place. I don't. Oh, what a toss! T if Taz is on commentary, I'm sure you can tell me what kind of toss that was. When, when Taz is around, you don't call him suplexes, you call him tosses. Oh, just gripping the 
Corso. Whoa! What? What happened to the lights? Oh my god! He's right behind him! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! Who's this monster? Oh! What a suplex! Oh god, Tim! Oh! Throwing hook! Holy shit, are we looking at an upset right now? Oh, what a splash! Dear god, I hope not! <laughs> There's no recovering from a loss from Tim! Oh, but Hook had enough of playing the games! Oh! Big fucking suplex on Tim's dome piece! Woo! Fucking hope he broke his goddamn neck! We got the cover! One! Two! Oh! Tim kicking out! Taz, you like you crafty bugger? But he got the red rub! Red rub's locked in! There's no way Tim can hang on! It's gotta be it for sure. No one can escape the red rub! Holy shit! <laughs> if there's someone persevering enough, it's Timbo. Nerf. Oh. <laughs> Tim, the <laughs> clothesline. <laughs> oh. Oh, Jesus! The Tempo Suplex! He actually hit it! Got the cover! Oh, and Hook, they got able to kick out at two. Oh, Jesus, Tim going up top. He wasn't able to catch Tim. Oh, big punch to the face, but Tim down with the elbow. Holy shit. Come on, Hook. This ain't okay. Oh, Tim throwing the hook into the corner right from his own father, the sick fuck. What is he doing? Whoa! Freaking Steiner off the top! Impressive agility nonetheless with the cover. One, two. Oh, hook. No. Je Jesus, the oversized load couldn't take it. Oh, hook struggling to get to his feet. Oh, Jesus, Tim. <laughs> oh, right after him. Oh, he's not stopping. He's doing this just to spite us. Gave this man no hope, no future. But he's trying, he's carving his own path. <laughs> Looking for another Timbo suplex, but not able to get him a second time. Oh, got a suplex of his own, though. Hook. A toss. A toss, you're right. My apologies. <laughs> not mean to be disrespectful. Oh, looking for a possibly another red rum though. But we could have two. He's got him hooked up again. Scissors are in. Ref is right there. And Tim has no choice but to tap. If she Get him out of here. Get him out. Wow. Way more performance than I was expecting, but Jesus. Oh. God. Put that crazy fucker down. <laughs> oh. Impressive nonetheless from both men. But Hook, regardless, coming out on top here tonight. I think it's this new outlaw variant of Timbo right now. He's, he's got that aggression. He's got a chip on his shoulder right now. But wasn't enough to beat Hook here tonight. Ending it with the red rum. Taz, Here's such a proud winner. father. Oh. Oh. If Taz wants to get in a few shots, he's more than welcome to. <laughs> get him in there. <laughs> Come on, Taz. You can, you can do it. He's right there. Oh. oh, whatever. Hook, your winner here tonight in your co-main event. First win for this young man in this company. Can't wait to see more of him in the future. But now, Hyde, we are at the main event. It is going to be Butch and the former FFW World Champion Grande in a tag team match taking on the butt crack bros js brody and your newly crowned ffw world champion but crack jack how does that sound i think it sounds amazing that's a name you can put on a marquee right there put that sell sell it in an arena but crack jack i could see it right now in lights bcj for short no no i'm, I'm paying for the extra letters it's cool oh shit <laughs> we're getting the butt crack jack anyway enough talking let's get to the main event all i want is a charmin sponsorship do ya? <laughs> Do ya? Yes, Whoa! Sir. Straight to the clear. ring, already in here. What the fuck? All right, bitch. Oh, skipping the entrances, straight to the, the breaker. <laughs> 
Butch also, as my partner calls him, Bitch. <laughs> Immediately <laughs> taking it to the bruiser weight right now. The reason I call him Bitch is that, you know, I, I am a big uh, advocate of vowels, you know? <laughs> and, course. you know, they say sometimes Y just because it's in the Indian alphabet. No, I think it should be sometimes U. Keep Y in there. So, so, we, so we doing like Take bitch out the U and put the bitch in. Oh, Jesus, Grande going right after butt crack here. Obviously with some revenge on his mind, but <laughs> uh, is, is it bitch with a Y, though? Are we doing it WWE style? Ooh, that's a good call. Mm -hmm. I'm all for it. Oh, immediately Butch right back into the ring, though. Oh, snap, Dragon! Center of the ring! One, but only a one count. Butch getting out of there. Oh, he's taking as aggression. Don't chance. Brody. Oh, German on the outside. Butt crack, though. Not standing for it. Oh, <laughs> he throws a trap. He's got the Kimura. The little hammer lock locked in tight. No. He's breaking my arm. But butt crack. Oh! <laughs> From breaking his arm to breaking his own arm. On Butch's face. <laughs> Throw it out for the bad guy. Oh, big. Elbow to the back of butt crack. Oh, a head butt to the back of the head. CTE. After that Hell in a Cell match last week. I can't be feeling good. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Butch is on fire right now. Taking on the butt crack bros. Oh, count of eight. Butt crack making it back into the ring, though. Collar and elbow. J oh, JS Brody. I think he was trying to hit Butch, but he accidentally hit butt crack. Oh, God. In the high rake. He's going for the nose. Oh, stop to the back. An unfortunate miscalculation there from J.S. Brody. Oh, and a big drop kick from the former world champ. Again, going for the pin. He just wants that pin back so bad. Oh, only a one count. Barely a one count. But crack straight back to his feet. Oh, my God. Grande with the power. Oh, but butt crack. It was oh. slide out the back. So super Slapped kick. Shit, I mean, spit out of him. Did you see that? <laughs> it did. It looked like you're going for a super kick, but not able to get it. No, oh, he's trying to do something similar, but Grande having it scouted. These two know each other so damn well. We just went through war, so it makes sense. Oh, Dominator! Oh, center of the ring. Desperately trying to crawl to Brody, but not able to get it. Oh, Grande, a handful of hair, taking it back to the corner of Butch or Bitch. Uh, Butch up top here. Oh, Grande over the knee. Oh, <laughs> double stop folding the world champion half. Butch giving him a piece of his mind. Oh, and a hair whip right into the ring. Whip it, whip it. Butch, Irish whipping the champ. Ah, oh, big clothesline. Butch really working over the world champ. He's had plenty of time to study uh, butt crack. He's been waiting for this moment. If you guys aren't familiar with why Butch is upset in the mid-championship tournament. Oh, x Black center of the ring. He got the cover. Whoa, J.S. Brody stopping nick of time. But in the mid-tournament, the match between Butch and butt crack, Butch grabbed the ropes and costing him the match because Buckrack still got the pin regardless because the ref didn't see it and he hasn't forgotten yet. Arguably, Butch could have gone on to win the whole tournament if it wasn't for that. Nah. He, he, ha he hasn't forgotten. He's gone on this whole time waiting, biding his time for a moment like this, but J.S. Brody's in. Grande is looking like he's looking at a ghost but going right after him. Not holding back a second. Set up power bomb. J.S. Birdie, one of the few people to get a pin over Grande in their original tag team match. Oh, but Jesus, Grande, he hasn't forgotten to home stone. But J.S. Birdie's too close to the ropes, but the ref, it's not close enough. Oh, J.S. Birdie, kick it out. Wow. Whoa, Gr J.S. Birdie back to his feet, throwing the boat. Oh, throw chop, cut chop, uppercut. J.S. Brody, vintage drop kick. Oh, he is feeling it here tonight. He would Absolutely. love nothing more than another win. Oh, oh Irish Chris. Wait, he's holding it. A second. Oh, my God. One more. A third. Irish oh Chris backbreaker. 
He was putting them in a wheelchair. <laughs> Going for the pin. One, two. Oh. oh, how is that not enough? Dear God, it takes one to put down most people. He took three in a row. But butt crack back into the ring. Finishing when he started. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but Butch able to stop him immediately. Grande looking for a big clothesline to hide out that. Very scouted. Whoa! Fire up a jack! And a kick up for show. Oh, but Grande sneaky little bastard going for a cover. One, but J.S. Brody able to break it up. Wisely getting out of there as quickly as possible. A pissed off Grande is not someone you want to be in the ring with. Oh, he not got Kuzu. Ooh, the power! Oh, vintage Goldberg there. Beautiful spine buster. Oh, I'm laying in the big elbow. The world champ. Something I'm sure Grande does not want to hear right now. Butch back into the ring. Going after butt crack here. Oh, bringing him down to the mat. Holding the arm in place. Knuckles to the back of the, back of the neck. Oh, that doesn't feel good. Big kick. But Butch going up top here. What's he got planned? Big double stop to the belly. Oh, taking the air out of butt crack. <laughs> Not a sentence I thought I would say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Grande. The big punch to the side of the head. Oh, setting up butt crack again. Oh, busting open the champ with another elbow. Butt crack stuck here in enemy territory. JS Brody nowhere to help in sight. Oh, looking for a famous sir, but not able to get all of it. Butch! Oh, wasn't able to get the cursed rebound. Oh, gotta go to another. Oh, a snap! Suplex this time. Oh, got his eyes on JS Brody, but JS Brody saw it coming. Looking after his tag team partner. He's calling him in. But Butch wisely avoiding the conflict. Oh, wait, J.S. Brody just walked away. Oh, what a shot from Butch. Man, okay, Brody. Oh, but he's paying for it. Oh, oh, God, this brings more DDT. Man, J.S. Brody just, oh, shit, chop block. He like headbutted your knee. But J.S. Brody right now, he must be out of it or something. This is, this is weird behavior. Uh-oh. Famous out the steps. Oh, the corner. Some Seth Rollins shit, man, going after his eye. Oh, <laughs> a little punch in for Grande. Oh, but Butch, he was distracted. The pit end. Got the cover, but no. JS was already there, ready to break it up. Oh, but he's looking for another one regardless. Another big forearm. Jesus, this is all it could take to win the champion. Another pit end. Stupidly going for the pin there, even though J.S. Brody is right there. Oh! No! Not even close. Not even close, but J.S. that time very slow to get to the ring. But butt crack with the cradle. One. Only a one count to the bruiser weight. Man. Butch putting in the work right now, though. Getting it back in the corner here with J.S. Brody. Oh! <laughs> the road is headed to the turnbuckle. Oh, he's not even tagging in J.S. Brody. That's very... Oh, but J.S. Brody that time. Oh, looking for the flash big. Oh, possibly stopped another bitter end. Oh, stop bringing him back to the turnbuckle. J.S. Brody's looking ready. Got the tag this time. What could we got? What could we get here? J.S. Brody... Or Buttcrack got him up vertically. Magic killer! Hey. Look at the boys. Look at the boys. A one? Man, Butch, I guess, has not taken a lot of damage in this match. I think Grande's taken most of it. Oh, knee drop, though. J.S. Brody bringing the damage. Busting open the bruiser weight. Oh, he did his damage, though. He's looking to bring back in the champ. What can we got here? Oh, he's putting Butch up. Oh, Jesus. Oh, he's got him up. The big old oh my muscle God. buster. And butt cracks up top. Double stop. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Keep him out. Keep him out, Jacobs. No. Oh, look, the butt crack is setting up a blunt force what? trauma, but br the bruiser weight wisely getting him out. 
Oh, being brothered up here at the announce table. Oh, dick to arm. Sorry, that magic killer. I had to pop one for the boys. <laughs> oh, looks like he might have been trying to set up a swamp crap there in this match again. Uh, Butch is out in the ring. Oh, but Grande Abraham had scouted this time. He got butt crack. Oh, butt, butt crack up. Big tombstone. But J.S. Brody is no. still there. Not a wise decision from the former champ, but J.S. Brody. Oh, just getting in there in the nick of time. Oh, but Grande caught him that time. He had no escape. Oh, God, he's got J.S. Brody up. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, but there's Jamie. Holy shit. What, what a combination. Two. Oh. oh, my God. How? This must be AEW. What the fuck? <laughs> that was the finish. Again. But first trauma to the former champ. One, two. <laughs> what the How? fuck? How? Grande still a monster. Overdrive. <laughs> Would that be enough to put him down? Oh, his butt crack's not done, though. He knows it's going to take so much more. Maybe another swamp crack, perhaps? No. Bring it in the big guns. Double super kick! Oh, J.S. Brody going right after Butch. Oh, big shoulder tackle. Oh, sunset flip. Oh, putting down the bruiser weight. Wise call, but Grande's on the outside. Butt cracks out to bring him in. Or oh, not. J.S. Brody's up top. A little miscommunication there, but butt crack wisely bring it back in the former champ. Oh, he's looking to set up something big here. Got the big Irish whip here on Grande. Oh, down low. Winds of change! Oh it got the cover in for the Butch. One, two, but Butch was oh. in there to save it. Nick of time. Oh, but Jacob, he's slithering. He can feel it. RKO center of the ring. This is what he beat Grande with last time. One, two. Oh, but Butch still there. Oh, my God. Man, this has been a, a, a hoot. Dude, I'm losing my voice. Whoa, <laughs> Grande looking for a pounce, but Jacob not there. But Crick back in the ring. But Grande getting a hold of him. Oh, big boot laying out the champ down to the cover, but Jacob right there to stop it. Oh, oh, just escaping Grande. Oh, and a big stomp to Butt Crack's head. Oh, but Grande. Oh, no. <laughs> Butt Crack's trying to stop it. Oh, he's able to stop it in the nick of time. That was close. Oh, Jesus, Butt Crack, what are you doing? Oh, oh DDT. God, Spike God damn. Oh, look at possibly for a deadlift suplex there. But Grande, he's still got his eyes set on J.S. Brody. Oh, oh, but Brody, able to see it coming a mile away. Butt Crack back in the ring. Big Irish whip of his own. Oh, Judas effect. We got the cover. One. Only a one. Butch in there every step of the way. I'm becoming, I'm becoming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, big shot to the belly again. Grande, though, setting a big gut wrench. And then a Dominator. Looking to dominate the champ right now. Bringing back in the big guns, bitch. <laughs> Getting butt crack back up to his feet. Oh, big elbow. Oh, big knee. Oh, axe handle laying it into the champ. Dragging him. Could this be enough to get a pit? Oh, I'm burping. I'm not even getting brothered up. Yeah, I'm burping. <laughs> oh, big jaw breaker. Every butt crack. Oh, he's got to set up again. Butt first job. Center of the ring. Grande already there. Oh, man. It's so close. But Buckrack had enough of that shit. <laughs> Get him after the no room. more. Oh, God damn it. I'm normally on top of that sort of thing. Oh, what's this? He got the game over. He's looking to redeem Butch. 
change his name perhaps. Oh, but a drop kick able to put a stop to that. J.S. Brody going after Grande though. They like to lock it up. Oh, J.S. Brody able to get Grande out of the ring. Butch leg and big haymakers. Oh, big toss, look out. Butch, back to the close line. Leapards! <laughs> oh, J.S. Brody laying it into the former champ out there. Oh, but Butch able to get the better end of Buckcrack. Snap, German! The cover, one, two, yay! Oh, <laughs> he's still fighting on the oh outside. But Butch just pinned the world champ. Oh, my God. I'm pissed. That's not going to work for me, brother. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Regardless, though, I mean, if there's any proof of a double contendership, that would be that. Here are your winners. Wow. Impressive Goliath. win here from Butch. Grande just Butch. riding his coattails, it feels like a lot of that match, man. Butch is on another level. Definitely someone to look out for, someone to worry about. Whew. All right. But that was everything tonight, folks. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you all next week, same time as always. Have a great night. Goodbye.